Only 70 people split up into small groups walking 250 miles of desert. Yet so profound were the consequences, so lasting were the effects of this walk, that from it the Muslims date their calendar. In this moment, Islam found its future. Muhammad himself stayed in Mecca in the greatest danger until all his followers had left safely. a nation. He has received a city, entered into pledges and treaties. And you, Salul, who claim to be king of Medina, lost the kingdom last night while you were in bed. You should worry about yourself, Busofian. Every time you trade a whiff of perfume up to Syria, you must creep past that man in Medina. He is across your mercantile throat, so to speak. And what do you intend to do? I intend to wait. And how long will you wait? Till you and the rest of Arabia remove him. To save your way of life. And while you wait? I shall accept his call, of course. Does he think I will give him my birthright? <laughs> I will not. Medina is worth the conversion. Hypocrisy. <laughs> call it a healthy hypocrisy. King Salul. Wiping his face on the floor five times a day, praying. I don't believe it. He may not have to. We'll do now what we should have done before. Kill Mohammed. Come. Come and see. They say that practice leads to perfection. Seven young men, each from a different family. My own son, Ekrima, is with them. They will stab him together. If the responsibility for his death is shared, where lies the guilt? My idea. I'm not sure I'm part of it. Muhammad's body contains too much. His mind, his words. But it is an ingenious solution. And a final one. cousin lay there to die for him? Who are we fighting? He cannot go far. All the tracks are watched. He must take to the desert. Mecca will give 100 camels to the man who brings back Muhammad or his head. Look for three of them. Muhammad, Abu Bakr, and Orakat is Bedouin guide. Ah! 
What is it? They're not grazing camels. They've eaten dates. They're from the city. Why are you here? Medina is to the north. They make the tracks. Not I. Nomads? Traveling west? I know my art. They say that you can track a bird by smelling the air. We go with them. Take you to make her alive. Mohammed, come out. They can't be in there. This this web is unbroken. And these pigeons. They would not build. We were wrong to follow them. We should have gone north. Let's move then. We still have time to head them off. Threads of a spider's web were all that was then between Mohammed and murder. But he was a man not to be killed. The Bedouin guide led him and his companion, Abu Bekr, in their escape through untracked spaces of the desert and the heat of the June days. At Medina, his followers waited with their welcome ready but in great fear for his journey. <laughs> 